What the fuck? Hide! Hide! Hello guys and welcome back to the channel. Please ignore the face. I've just finished recording a game and then realised that I still needed to test the makeup for my Halloween and then forgot that I hadn't done the intro for this. I mean of course you could have just washed it off but I wanted it all done tonight but so just ignore it. But anyway we're playing the Masked Devourer. Basically we're a travel blog person. We break into an abandoned uh, Japanese city and we encounter a missionary who's there spreading the word to Jesus and he tells us that there's something bad in the city and the only way to stop it is to get his bag and of course he doesn't want to get the bag we have to get the bag so i'll just jump straight into the game <clears throat> it is really gives you quite a few jump scares gets your heart going anyway so i hope you enjoy it if you're new to the channel like script comment all that stuff and um yeah let's just jump right in oh okay it's just um kind of chucked us in here there's a big question is gonna run Finally got in. Okay, the recording is going just fine. So, everyone, welcome to my blog. Whether you know me or not, I'm Katie. Today, we are going to explore an abandoned, mysterious city in Japan. Actually, I promised to you that I will visit an Inaki tunnel, but I couldn't get past this location. It said it was once a populated city, but one day some strange disease started to spread and everyone had to move out. But it's just a legend. I'm pretty sure it's just another mining town with a tough history. Anyway, let's take a walk around the town then, shall we? I like that this has got voice acting in it because I, normally if there isn't I use AI to create voices so people don't have to um, read stuff but I am quite happy this has already got the voice acting. Okay, so uh, the music is already creeping me right out. Sorry, I just need to put everyone on do not disturb. The minute you sit down to do something, the whole world wants to um, get in touch with you. Okay, right. So we are obviously a blogger. <clears throat> We're snuck into this, I would say, restricted area, um, and we are looking for this abandoned city. So yeah, quite a good, quite a good, um, quite a good idea actually, because there are places like this in Japan and. Um, where they've just built entire cities and they've just completely got rid of them. Do you have to run? Wow, I'm a fast runner, really fast. Oh, sugar, that's airtight. Where did I? Right, I came in here, so I think uh, I'll go this way. Okay, this is the first place worth visiting, just behind that three gate. So, how can I get there? This gate? Right, so I can't get in that way. Let's try... Oh. Oh. Okay, so we've came off the street. And this is a uh, just a, a walkway. The no fear. What the hell is that? What a strange altar, and that mask. Hello. That is nightmare fuel. What the fuck? 
Holy shit, that is so fucking creepy. Like, that could be in a movie, like, horror. When skillfully used, masks can be an extremely dramatic form of ex- What were you thinking? You unleashed it. Unleashed what? Can't move. What? <clears throat> Who are you? Oh no. I have no time for this. You must assist me, please. Don't come closer. <laughs> okay. You need to listen. Stand still. What is this all about? Is this a joke? Very funny. I am a Catholic missionary. I travel across Japan spreading the word of Jesus. Okay. So you're now trying to accost me in the middle of a haunted city. You're going way in, over and above your um, job description there. My bus stopped in this city. And I sent some strange aura coming from this area. So I came. Listen to this music. What the fuck? What just happened to me? I'm not really sure. I can explain everything later. Mm. All I need to do is to help me with the ritual. Let me just grab my... I can't believe it. I'm sure that my bag was with me when I came to town. Oh no, it's lost his bag. Maybe you've left it on your way there? We can go together and check. I can't go. I need to buy some time. I will be performing a restraining ritual while you are looking for my bag. You can go and check out the bus stop first. So I have to find the bag? Are you just going to look at me wherever I go? Bus stop, right? Where's the bus stop? Right, so all that's in here really is a hiding place. I think I can hide inside of those trash boxes. Ew. Ew. Sprint. Where's the bus stop? What the fuck? This is really eerie. So I can't go this way. stop. What is that noise? Hide! Jesus, what is it? What the fuck? Hide! Hide!
the fuck was that? It's just a giant head! What the hell am I meant, how am I meant to find this bloody bag with that thing everywhere? I don't see the bag here. got me right on edge <clears throat> oh of okay, it came this way God, it got me! Will, will it let me tell him that I can't find his bag? Oh God, oh God. Hey, let, 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 let this spill back up before I go <clears throat> running back out to, to Mega Brain. Does that mean I need to make my way back? I think I can hide inside of those trash boxes. Ew. To the bus stop just to, to show that it's not there. Holy shit, this... Thing. I genuinely don't know when it's coming. I can hear that noise all the time. So it could be down the bloody road. It could be right next to me. Like it's so difficult to know. Turn round. I don't see the back here. Maybe they have a look and found in that convenience store. Oh, at least I'm inside. Please tell me it cannot get me in here. Oh, thank God it's saved. Oh, 
Right, so I need a tool to unlock the drawer. What about this? <clears> hey, <throat> okay, the cash register is jammed again. Where's the toolbox? Also, have you already checked out the new blue vending machine in front of my house? It malfunctions. I think something is stuck inside. Oh, the bag is lost behind the shower. It must find the way in. Right, so the bag is definitely round here. Right. So now I'm looking for a blue vending machine outside of a house. Where does he live? Where is it? <gasps> Here it comes! Hide! The blue vendor machine. Jesus Christ! Fuck off! Fuck off! <clears throat> You've already been here! Go away! Checking we've still got our stuff. Um. Closed. Oh, the key works for here. Why did I not try that before? <clears throat> Another key with address on it. Guess I should find the apartment mentioned in the letter. Oh, there's a letter. 
I don't understand what's happening in the town. Some people just go out at night and never return. By the way, I'm not the slow reading it's this is the way the text is. <laughs> My shift is ending. It's getting dark, but I have to finish work on the roof of that red sun graffiti building. I'll be back soon. So I need to find a house that's got graffiti on it and the red sun. Okay, well first I'm going to go back to the shop and save. Save, save, save. Game saved. Right. So we're now looking for a house that's got red, red graffiti on it. Oh, you bitch! You never gave me a chance! You never gave me a chance! Ah! Red Sun Graffiti? Is this it? There's no door. Bitch, where are you? So that's definitely a red sun graffiti. Is the door maybe around the other side? Fucking bitch, fucking bitch, little bitch. Can the bitch get in here? She must. I've got to hide. It's fucking broken. Right. What did I pick up? from up here. Oh, is this, are these the generators? Oh, a key. Power substation. Okay. Why would their toolbox be away up here?
Hello, Aunt Lady. Are you here? Oh, she's getting louder. There she is. Look at her. What the hell? She's huge. Oh my god. Get me in, get me in. Uh, we need to come here anyway because we've got the the thing now. What is this? I wonder if we go back to that blue vending machine with that. Right, let's save the game again just a moment. Right, I wonder. It just sounds really close. Go away, bitch. I'm just going to do little bursts. gone for a little while. I know I'm being a total pussy and saving this every time I do something, but it's just so much effort because she's she's really she just she just comes on quick. Oh god she's back, right. <clears throat> Behind the shutters. Yeah. You must find the way in. And, and this, this to me looks like power station, kind of, right? I mean, there's, there's like a open box. So I think if I just go out and I turn left and then make a left and then it should hopefully, I'm going to run because she's away for a little while. Um. Oh god. So this is behind the shop. Can I get his bag? No, I still can't get his bag. So the power's on, what does that do? Oh my god, she's huge! Right, so at least she can't get me in here. Um, god, uh, I've nothing else in the inventory. It says I've got a fuse and I haven't. Do you think maybe I'll go back to the shop and try and open the shutter? I think maybe that's why we needed the power. Oh, it's opened! So now I need to get back to him with his bag. And then, could that be us? Oh, she sounds really close, right? So basically, I need to get back to that park, which is all the way down next to the blue um, red sunrise graffiti house. No bitch! Oh, <laughs> you bitch! You bitch! She just went round the corner that I need to go round. Hide! 
God, God, I just need to get to the park. I need to get to the park. It's just here. It's just here. Oh. Hopefully she can't get in here. Right, Mr. Man. You found it. Yes, I found it. What was that thing in the city? It was hunting me down. I barely survived. Well, actually, we died like twelve times, I think. So. Wait a second. You saw a big centipede-like creature. And it had that mask from the theater. I didn't expect this creature would emerge so quickly, but it's over now. We can begin the ritual. Thank God. Katie, did you take something out of my bag? No. Why? The items we need are missing. I know it's dangerous outside, but you need to help me out last time. No! Where is the closed market in the second part of the town? I think you can find something like incense burner. But the last thing we need. Take the key. I have left it on the altar. Also, I have something for you. This is a candle. It can protect you from the monster for a short while. Use it with caution. It burns out quickly and feel slowly. May the Lord bless you and keep you. Good Lord. All right, so <clears throat> here we go. Um, let's just keep this in our hand. The only place I remember being locked is here. Oh, flashlight. How do I use it? Oh, F, as usual. And then, of course, it tells me at the top. So we're looking Where for... Where am I supposed to find that thing? Insert wall. How does my candle work, by the way? Traditionally used in a theatre, no masks are con considered to be supernatural. The legend says that a mask is able to absorb the negative energy of its owner. The no mask comes to life once it has enough energy. It continues to drain a person's energy and it can even communicate with his owner. The mask continually insists on wearing it all the time. Softly whispering disturbing things. Sorry. The only purpose of its behaviour is to constantly receive energy from the owner. 
Once the owner dies, they can even possess its body, merge it with some animal and grow into a terrifying creature. One page seems to be missing. Oh my god, you got, I have a funny feeling I've got to go back to the start and put that. Charge the candle. I need to make sure I can get back to the shop. <sighs> so now we just need to get out. Okay. Thank God, all the diamonds are done. I just need to get out, but I'm waiting for my candle to come back. So I need to get back to the green statue. Is it over now? Incapable. 
little bit. But you, Katie, you are a survivor. You are strong enough to accept the mask. I don't want the mask. My poor wife. She was a great actress, but she took on the mask by mistake. That's his wife? I'm sure you were. The mask told me everything. And we made a deal. My Julie, I can finally be born. You are the key. The most capable vessel. The mask chosen you. Now, let me leave you for a while. I must prepare. A candle. I am not looking back. I am not looking back. I've got my candle. Did I make it? In my scariest nightmares, I see that town, and I can't forget it. I struggle to remember its name, though the day is imprinted in my memory so strongly that I can't get it out of my head. My camera still doesn't turn on. I tried to save the recording, but it seems to be corrupted. I don't have any logical explanations for those events. I wish I could explain what I've seen, but I just... I really want to find answers. I found an antique shop on the internet that sells old no theater props. I ordered a similar mask. It's expected to be here today. I will get my answers. I don't think that's a good idea, Katie. Well, that was a really, really, really time-consuming game. I think I've played it for about two hours. Um, it really is good, though, at keeping you on your seat. I have said that throughout the play. Um, I'm going to keep in the first few times I died in the city, and then I'm probably going to just edit down the the last place, because I spent so long in there. It really was so bad, but... Um, Anyway, if you really enjoyed this um, as much as I did playing it, um, please do consider giving me a like and a subscribe, and please comment. It's free. All of it's free. It really does help a guy out. Um, thanks for tuning in, and I will see you all in the next one.